with Dave. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Play With Dave, and welcome back to South Park The Fractured Butthole. We just got in a fight with our fellow Kun and friend companions who are civil warring us. Kunstagram. The mayor of South Park wishes to speak with you. Don't make her wait. Well, okay. And now I have an option. Oh, let, me, uh, let me pull up the big map. So now I have an option. I can go and meet with the mayor. But it's not even giving me a, a quest thing there. Hey, I'm supposed to go back to uh, the Coon Lair. But I think I might go see what the, what the mayor wants. I mean, why the hell not, right? It's the mayor, for Christ's sake. South Park could use some more female heroes. I agree. But you know, the... The girls, they've been getting a lot more, uh... TV time than they used to. They've become quite the integral part of the show. Not that they never were before. Just saying. Hello, young person. I'm the mayor of South Park. You must be very excited to be here. Not really. Well... All right, look, you might be able to help me. This new crime wave in town, it isn't a coincidence. Some group or someone is trying to make me look bad. The more crime goes up, the more people start calling for my head. Whoever is behind this wants to see me get replaced. I need people like you. Please, find out who is behind the crime wave in our town. My political life depends on it. Cancel all my meetings today! Uh, you don't have any meetings today, ma'am. Excellent. Keep up the good work, Aid. Huh. The mayor used to be so hilarious. I mean, she kind of fell off the bandwagon as one of the key funny characters. But she was like, she was always, she always had some really good lines and funny stuff in, uh, in the first season. So, she pretty much just gave me an obvious mission, so not really much to do there, My just... parents were out partying until 3 a.m. last night. WTF! What the fuck? <laughs> so, now we're going back to Cartman's house, because there's nothing else to do. Let it be known that the Coon and Friends have defeated the Freedom Pals in Civil War. Nice. The fucking Freedom Pals. <clears throat> Fastest kid in town. <clears throat> okay. Oh, oh, there we go. Righteous. I knew there was one there. I just wasn't clicking on it. I was clicking on the mission icon. Oops. Alrighty. Now for the fiftieth thousand time, we gotta put in the code. Fuck. Fuck. You. Mom. Mom. I wonder if he'll ever change the code or if it's just going to be ah, that way the whole game. Alright, let's get to work. Alright, what are we doing, guys? What have you found, Super Craig? Timmy's phone has a bunch of notes in it. Something about a girl who has information about all the criminal She's activities. She's got it under a microscope. It just says, find the girl with the dick tattoo. Well, what? The girl in town has a dick tattoo. I don't know, Mosquito, but the Freedom Pals must think she's the key to finding the missing cat. If the Freedom Pals find her before we do, they'll get the $100 reward. We cannot let that happen. We have to stop the Freedom Pals from having a sweet franchise. At all costs. Then we have to find the girl with that tattoo tonight. Fast Pass is right. We all have to sneak out of our houses tonight and search the entire town. What do you say, new kid? Are you up for it? Oh, so we're gonna... It's gonna be dark out? Look, if you want to be a coon friend, you have to learn to communicate. Yeah, who let this guy join us anyway? Go easy on him, you guys. He's had a tough life. When he was six years old, his dad fucked his mom. <laughs> what? Cos like, huh? I'm sorry, friend, but it's time they learned your tragic backstory. Butthole doesn't trust anyone because his dad fucked his mom and he couldn't do anything to stop it. That doesn't make any sense. I know. How could the person you trust do that to the only other person you love? Carmen, everyone's dad fucked everyone's mom. 
Change out of costume. Okay, sure. Are you sure your might level is lower than recommended for the next day's action? Oh, okay. Well, then no. So, yeah, I just kind of wonder, you know, why, if there was going to be civil war, then why would Kyle align himself with Cartman? That's just, that goes against nature. I don't know. <clears throat> Make with the superheroing, new kid. Chop, chop. So I guess I gotta go home. And then we'll sneak out when it's dark, and maybe I'll get to find out who's been fucking with uh, Randy's car. Hey, Forthy! Doing some Wanna see a naked picture of your mom? No. Doing some final tests at the Kite Line Express. See God later, damn it! Forthy. I'll be waiting for you. I wanted to read it, but these douchebags were fucking with me. Look at all my chimp Pokemon! <laughs> Okay. It's asking me again. No. Don't change out of my cup. Okay, I guess I have to. Oh, we gotta do it ourselves. Shablagu. Nice. What are you doing even talking to the school counselor? Why'd you answer the phone? Have you lost your fucking mind? Our child felt the need to go talk to the school counselor. Doesn't that bother you at all? So you told him the truth? No, we didn't talk about that at all. You dumb bitch! You'll ruin everything! Jeez, I mom and dad. From a stoned out pothead. I need a drink. Sure, drown your problems in Chardonnay, you stupid <clears throat> skank. Oh, hey, whippersnapper. Have a fun day out playing? No, <laughs> well, I'm exhausted. Gonna get ready for bed. Dinner's on the table if you want it, punk. But then straight to bed, okay? Pothead. Alcoholic. Jeez, y'all got some issues you need to work out. Eat my dinner. <laughs> I'm sad and depressed because my parents are fighting. Uh, dinner by myself. I ate one bite. Really? Okay. Go to your room and sleep. We'll be out for dinner all night, new kids, so feel free to use the kite base on the mission. Whatever. Okay, well, I guess it's time for bed. Sweetie, I just want you to know that whatever happens, Mommy always loved you. Good night, sweetheart. Loved me? Past tense? After you've been drinking? That's a bit scary. That's when the creeps come out. But unfortunately for the creeps, the other thing that comes out at night is a key. Is a key. Fucking love the coon. Okay, escape. How do we escape? But well, first, we must transform. All right, how do we escape? Can't go out the window. New kid, Captain Diabetes will lead you where our intel has placed the girl with the dick tattoo. If you can, what? Oh, it's it was a comment. If you can handle this sidekick gig, you might have a chance at being a superhero one day. Wait, so if New Kid and Diabetes are looking for the girl, what is the mission that we're doing? That's classified, Human Kite. Okay, but I literally don't know where to meet you. I'll text you. Okay. We'll be out for dinner. All night, kids will feel free to use the cut base on the mission tonight. Oh, okay. So they went to Shitty Walk. Doing some final test. The Kite Line Express to Main Street is almost open for business. Oh, wow. Has he got his own fast travel system, too? That's crazy. Anyway, so we got to meet Scott Malcolmson, aka Diabetes. Oh, oh Jesus! Good kitty. Good kitty. 
So no so not only was he smoking the stickiest of danks. I mean, look at those buds, man. Those things are huge. Uh, he was also drinking. Kids, I mean, if you want to do one thing or the other, that's great, but don't ever mix it. I mean, you're just asking for trouble. You're not going to have a good time. Don't forget, you can use your snapping pops to knock things down. See ya, bud. Yeah, well, I guess I got to knock that down then. Uh, who's there? Who? <laughs> Nobody, Dad. Just keep sleeping your drunken stone sleep. No, stay out. Stay out. Okay, it's still locked. How do I... Just stay in tonight. I guess I gotta find a key. Maybe it's on my pops. No. Aha. Knock that down. There we go. What's the... Uh, it bothers me that I can't remember how to do that. You just hover over it and it doesn't do anything. You throw something at it, it doesn't do anything. It doesn't matter because I got the key and I'm going to unlock the door and I'm going to get the fuck out. Fucking Scott Malcolmson. Captain Diabetes. Yeah. A mild mannered gentleman with the power of diabetes at his control. I used to be a simple elementary school student, but then one day, a freak science accident turned my diabetes into superhuman strength. All right, sidekick. We're supposed to go investigate a girl who might know the location of the missing cat. Follow me. I'm curious about the girl with the dick tattoo. Ready? Let's go, sidekick. Kyle's his wife. And how do you use... What is the power of diabetes? I did. I, I thought it was a, an ailment, but whatever. Lead the way, Cap. Oh, here we go. He's doing it himself! Okay. Well, move out of the way, huh? I need to go buy some more beer. I'm sorry, but Captain Diabetes cannot let you drive. I'm fine to drive, okay? I'm fine to drive. Hey, give me my keys. You are in no condition, sir. I'm fine, okay? Look, wait, look, look. I'm fine. Okay? <laughs> give me my keys. I'll return them tomorrow. Get him a fucking key, you little shit! See, this is why alcohol is bad. You don't get that way when you get stoned. But anyway, that's a debate for another day. So it looks like Captain Diabetes and his sidekick. You little shit fuckers! You little shit fuckers! We're gonna take down Randy. So here we go. Drink. Drunken Randy. Okay, what do you got? Uh, brutal double punch with knockback. Dash attack that also grants protection. That's pretty good. Knockback and slow foes gain protection. Oh, geez, that's like a little bit of everything. Let's do that. Nice. Hey, you kids want me to pick you up some candy from the store? Whoa, whoa, whoa. How'd I end up over here? Oh my god, Randy. Alright. Time for a uh, double attack. I thought this was America. Isn't this America? <laughs> I'm sorry, I thought this was America. Uh, so fucking funny. Am I not gonna hit him? He's in my path. Not even buzzed anymore. What do you say? You just give me those keys. Oh. What do you say? You just. Give me my fucking keys. <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. It's really not because people act like this in real life, and it's annoying. Yeah, they get drunk and they think they're fucking Billy Badass and can do anything they want. That's how people get killed. I shouldn't laugh, but goddamn it, fucking Randy. He's funny, okay? I can't help it. And I just you fucked that up. That would have totally hurt if I could feel anything. Hey, I think I dropped my keys. Anyone seen them? <laughs> I can't believe I did that without falling. Hey, 
All right, let's let's butt stop him. Let's try to gross him out. Maybe he'll have extra effects since he's drunk. I fucking hate all you guys right now. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hate all you guys right now. There, that was a lot better. Give me my goddamn keys. <laughs> Okay, okay. It's 11 a.m. somewhere. Okay, uh, I don't want to use my alt on him. I, I want to see what Captain Diabetes is, so let's just give him a, a beam attack. Fuck me. Fuck me. Alright. Uh, brutalize a knockback column of foes. Yeah, let's see it. Oh shit! Oh my god, Scott, you're a badass! High fructose death wave! Dude, Captain Diabetes, he's fucking badass. I hope I get to keep you around. Maybe you'll be my sidekick. All right, Randy. I want to take a picture of this so you know who's keying your car, but I just got the thing for the mission, so I guess you're just going to have to realize the don't truth. All right, here we go. Okay, I can't wrap this stuff right now. Kyle's off on another mission right now. We're on our own, sidekick. It's up to us to get to the bottom of this. The shortcut's up there in the attic. The coon gave us permission to use it. Okay. Sometimes, when I have too much sugar, I get really angry and strong. I call it my diet. Yeah, I saw it, dude. It was fucking awesome. You, like, turned into the Hulk after eating candy. That's every little kid's dream. Okay. Farts See. make me angry. The coon says it's because my mom farted when she gave birth to me, and that's why I have diabetes. I, I don't think that's why I have diabetes, though. I think it was a gift. A <laughs> like crime. <laughs> the shortcut is through that window. I don't have my own secret base, but if I did, at least I'll clean it up before I knew I had super guests coming over. Hey, look, it's Couldn't his, uh... The for it. Gee. Shut up, Scott. I'm trying to talk. Jesus. It's his, uh, fucking elf outfit from, uh, Stick of Truth. You got a kite. You got a shirt with a kite. You got some clouds. What else we got? Doesn't look like... Any other references that I can see? There's something back here. There we go. I can move the ladder for hmm, something. Keep his a little more tatty. Let's. What are we supposed to be looking for? Are we just hanging out, or? Hang on. Let's move this over here. Oh, I got a hold. That's right. There we go. I this shortcut will take us right into turn the, the fan on. Downtown South Park. What does that do? Come on, Jacket. Do not be afraid. Nothing. Okay. Anyway. Oh, we're gonna zip line. Is that the human cut express? The fearless hero and his sidekick descend into the dark night, ready to strike down evil and bring peace to the city. You don't think people get diabetes because their mom started doing childbirth, do you? I, I feel like <laughs> <laughs> the fucking narnar of the zip line. Sounds like it's a different place. What's the? F oh, we're going to the strip club. Are we gonna come across the dads? Anybody like a dads? That's locked. Can't talk to this guy. This dude's just pissing. Everybody's partying. What the fuck's going on? Something going on. What is that? Blood. Something county. Is it a is it a concert? Is there a concert tonight? This bitch is passed out. Everyone's getting their drink on. Yes, we're closed. It's opposite what you should be saying. 
best band in the fucking world. Yeah, it's a concert. Burnham County. So it's like a country rock band. Hey, will you be my friend on Instagram? I guess not. <clears throat> I gotta pee. Back of the line, asshole. I got my legs of you, Justin Brick. Just from apple juice? So much sugar. There's so much sugar. Fuck yeah. Yeah, I guess that's one way to say it. Where's the Burnham country? I want to see this band. God, there's fucking beer cans everywhere. These fucking slobs. Who cleans up all this shit? Here it is. There we are. Here's where we're going to find the girl. There are sure to be unsavory characters and lots of boobies inside. <laughs> All right, everybody, here we go. Uh, this may be a mature warning. You know, I, I might have to do some censoring because I'm pretty sure they're not going to hold back and we're going to see some titties in here. So, kids, don't get in trouble with your parents. I'm going to censor this anyway. You shouldn't be watching this. This is not for you. Get out of here before I fucking throw you out. Now fucking throw you out. Hmm. What to do? Hmm. There must be another way in somewhere. Yep, that's what we're looking for, Scott. Look at your sidekick. Away in. Oh, All there, we there we go. There. I didn't even Great see that. Work, now we just need a way up there. Um, can I pull something over? Hmm. Diabetes will find your way in. Oh, he do your course. thing? Stand aside, sidekick. Yep, he's gonna do his thing. <sighs> I never knew there was so much sugar in apple juice. I mean, I knew there was sugar in it, but not enough to mess with diabetes. And then she needed an insulin shot every single time. After, after you. All right, going in. Oh boy. Oh, what, Tally? You got some components out of there. You can craft all kinds of things from components. I know, Tally. Jesus Christ! It's what the fuck is that doing up there? Ah, uh, that's gross. What? I don't want to take it? Gentleman's juice? Oh my god! That's fucking wrong. Novice toilet tanker. You get fucking experience for doing that. That's awesome. Yep, there we are. Yep, there's some titties. The VIP room, huh? Destiny. <laughs> I always loved the DJ. He always made me laugh. He was like, all right, we got a lot of shit going on. I'm sure Tippy Wins, let's hear it for Rebecca. All right, um, wandering around a strip club. Yeah, I hear you little shit. Oh, dude, there's uh, Kenny and Butter's dad. And those are the two guys from the fucking, uh, or at least one of them, the, the British Holocaust guy right here. <laughs> so awesome. Alright, uh... Oh, that's just like sparkling. I can't do anything to it. Entertainment, am I right? yeah. Seriously, kids, beat it. I'm, I'm actually busy. Okay, hi, Destiny. 
there's uh, Nelson. And uh, what's his name? He was in one of the... Oh, I mean, he's... He got introduced in the uh, People from the Future episode, and he actually has a name. Oh, wow. America, fuck yeah. <laughs> but yeah, Jimbo and Ned, obviously, but I can't think of that redhead redneck's name. He has an actual name, but they gave him to him uh, in the one of the newest episodes oh, that they had. Like the most epic night of my life. Okay, so private. I guess we're going in there. I still want to look around and stuff, though. Take. What was I going to take? Gin and tonic. Oh, it's a mission item? That's cool. I haven't even got a mission for it. Alright, let's go in here. Could raid some more stuff. Good, good, good. What is that? How do... Give me information on that. I'm pushing buttons and it's not letting me do anything. Oh well. Let's blow that open, maybe? Nope. So we gotta stand on something, I'm assuming. That's the way out. That's a way out. I wonder if I can blow up this pro painting. Nope. Oh, but I did start a fire! Oh, it's gotta, it's gotta be this one. There we go. Bookers and come. Whoa! <laughs> it's a mission item. Fucking boogers and come. Oh my god, it's terrible. All right, well I guess that's all I can do in here. So I guess we're going into the Whoa, VIP. And take them to the VIP room. Oh, we gotta get a girl. God, my bad. My bad. Alright. So if I was in a strip if I was in this strip club and I was gonna take somebody to VIP. I need to change my catheter. I mean, I like your tattoos and I've always had a thing for bigger girls. I mean, I like girls of all sizes, but I don't know, like I <laughs> Skinny girls are fine, but if they're too skinny, then they fucking hurt. But, I don't know, she's, she's got nice hair, she's got good makeup, I like her outfit, she's got a nice butt. Let's go with her. Can't you look too young to be in here? No. Find a stripper to take the VIP. Oh, so, I don't get to choose? They get to choose for me? Well, let, let, let's check out this girl. Come back when you're 21 and I'll let you suck on my infant. Suck on my implants. Yeah, that sounds sexy. Let me tell you. All right, my little chocolate cream. How about you? No, I want to go VIP with you. Okay, well we got to talk to Captain Diabetes. I can't get a dance. Whoa. At least it had a tassel on it, so I don't have to worry about that. Oh my god, Scott. Have you ever had dances from a girl with a penis tattoo? Hey, we didn't come back here to talk, baby. Yeah, no talking until you finish grinding on our chubs. Oh, all right. Okay, so I take the <laughs> <laughs> Lap dance minigame? Are you fucking serious? No! <clears throat> yeah, no shit, Tally. You're definitely gonna need a towel. Oh my god, this is just like the shitting minigame. Oh, this is terrible. I'm farting on him. <laughs> so wrong. Oh, 
Oh my god. Jesus, babe, you're stinking up the VIP room. It's like I'm twerking and farting at the same time. This is so fucked up. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna throw up too, buddy. I wouldn't either. This is so bad. <laughs> oh, wait. I, I didn't even see. There we go. Oh, I'm not dead yet. Let's just talk. I had to gross him out. Lap dance complete. Oh, my God. Okay, chat time. Chat time? Oh, man. <laughs> Dance with a girl here who has a penis tattoo? Why do you keep talking about a stripper with a penis tattoo? Yeah, yeah, Classy, that's her name. Her name is Classy? Yeah, Classy with an I and a little dick that hangs off the C which fucks the L out of the ASS. Okay. Yeah, Classy! I remember Classy! Okay, what are you talking about? This is the worst VIP experience ever. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. You ain't going nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> I am the ordinary stripper. I am Captain Diabetes. What? My sidekick and I simply used our powers of disguise to extract information from you. Hey, you won't get away with this, Captain Diabetes. Well, uh, looks like we got a fight on our hands. The VIP Johns. Oh shit, my boner is weighing me down. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. Dude, this is so fucking wrong. <laughs> but we should be able to take these guys out, no problem. Me and Captain Diabetes. Actually, I'm going to stand back and get this guy. There we go. Make them come to us. I'm going to call the Better Business Bureau and tell them you only gave me half a job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're... What a, customer looks like, bitches. What, a, what a terrible business we run. They only give you half a chub. We're fucking nine, nine-year-old little boys. And you're concerned about your chub. Okay, no, no. They're all in a straight line. Son of a bitch. I can't do a damn thing. Oh, I can, I can do this one. There we go. Yes. Anyone like a dad? There she is. <laughs> Anybody like a dance? Alright, let's uh, let's curse this guy out. There we go. Oh shit, I think I sprained my dick. I sprained my dick? Oh my god. I know a strip club. Oh, oh. Yeah, you don't feel so good, do you, buddy? You get a chump for five bucks in Thailand. <laughs> All right, let's keep working on this douchebag. Ah, uh, I can't get him. I'm gonna have to get this guy instead. <clears throat> That's the last time I pay for a high-priced twenty-dollar stripper. Oh wow, the table's gone. That's cool. That's cute. Whatever, cute. Uh, this might take him out. There we go. One down, one to go. I got a job in Thailand from a girl who had her own job. Hey, no more that bitch for you. Dude, you Scott's a fucking tank, you know? He gets that protection on and it stacks and you just can't fucking hurt him. Uh, there we go. Yeah, now we got him where we want him. You're mine now. I like your style, me kid. Go ahead and attack me if you must. Oh shit. Damn. Ah, uh, I can't get over there to pick myself up. It's okay. We should be able to take him out, no problem. <laughs> I do. Yeah, we 
still got experience. So we're good. Great work, new kid. Now let's get back to the main floor. All right, guys. Oh, there's some more titties. Be sure to tip your waitresses and maybe buy a drink for the DJ. Next up on the main stage, we've got a little bit of hot sauce coming up your way. Let's give it up for Esmeralda. Esmeralda. That's it. The DJ calls the bitches names, and then the bitches come out of that back room. Nuke, we need to find a way to distract the DJ. <gasps> I got it. Gin and tonics always make my mom pass out. If we can make one and spike it with something really strong, he'll be out for sure. Go make that drink, sidekick. Okay, well, I went ahead and, and I got the gin and tonic. So we have to craft it. <clears throat> find a free gin and tonic, find a special ingredient. Was that the boogers and cum? Uh, let's see. Yeah, I need one other thing. I don't know what the fuck that is, but I'm gonna have to find it. Around here. There we are. Meat grease, lard, and the fucking rat. Hmm. Hmm. Got an antidote. Okay, let's break this. So that's how I get up. That's how I get up. There we go. Rat shit. That's what it was. Alright, let's craft it. Crap. Doesn't say it does. Do you think it's gross enough to knock the DJ out of commission? I think it is. Boogers come and fucking ratchet. Find and uh, craft the... What? Oh, God. oh I farted oh, on God. it. Fart! <laughs> Sorry you had to see that, psychic. But nothing in this world makes me more angry than fart. It awakens the deep-seated rage that I harbor within me. I wish it didn't have to be fart. But that'll definitely take the DJ out long enough for us to call out Classy. Well, dude... Why don't you just, like, let me fart on you to get your super fucking strength rage instead of, you know, taking your life at risk? I mean, fuck, Scott. You got diabetes. You gotta take it easy, man. Alright, let's go and fuck up the DJ. Hallelujah. Alright, someone finally bought the DJ a drink. That's really nice of you. That went down really good. The DJ sure does appreciate it. Oh, oh man, I think someone farted in my drink, guys. I'll be right back. Be sure to tip your winters. Nice job, Scott. Uh, that's right, guys. Let's get her on out here. That's classy with an eye and a little dick that fucks the hell out of the ASS. Give it up for classy. Hey, what you calling me out for? I ain't on stage yet. Wait there a minute. You ain't the DJ. That must be her new kid. Oh, shit. It's 5 0. Cops are here. Really? Little kid cops? I mean, I know that was an episode, but come on. Come on, Classy. Take some time to pick some shit up. The dazzling orb. Boy, it's, a, it's an artifact. Here, nice. All right, I guess we're going in here. They after me, lady. Stop them. We're going to have to fight the Nobody's strippers. Back here. Yeah, get lost. Then the guy, lady. Captain Darby and his sidekick need to question that stripper. You want to get to her? You're going to have to go through us. That's a yes. Oh man. Alright guys, this is your DJ back from the bathroom. Looks like we've got a special treat for you tonight. The two assholes that farted in my drink are about to get fucked in the face by our very own lovely ladies. <laughs> I am I implore you to stand down, ladies. I love this music that we keep having to fight with. It's fucking awesome. Oh wow, I get a twofer. Nice. Give it here. Motherfucking cocksucking little brick. Here comes our favorite flower of fellatio. Give it up for Fuchsia. Fuchsia. Alright, one of these has a knockback. 
And it's this one. Nice. Damn, she's already down. <laughs> Don't let Classy escape. Oh, fuck. We can't let her go. Give it up for Paris. Ooh la la, need I say more, guys? We've got to run the ropes, and I can't keep moving. She comes to us straight from the Coca Cabana. You know who I mean. A big hand for our luscious Lola. Lola. Oh shit, don't knock us back. No. Damn it, that's not. This is not close enough. And I don't want to. Well. I guess it'll get him out of my way. I, I was I was gonna want to knock him the other direction, but it's not gonna let me. Did it just get a lot spicier in here? Oh, that's why it's Esmeralda. It's Esmeralda. Uh oh. Got that nose. She's got like a Michael Jackson nose going on. All right. Uh, get this bitch out of the way. <clears throat> and subbing in from the day shift, give it up for Blaze. Hey, can we turn the house Is that her name? Yeah, no kidding. Everybody like it. Damn it. Keep knocking us back. This is not cool. Wish I could do something about that bitch. But I can't. Come and get me, boys. Here's a treat. No. <laughs> All right. Time to take you bitches out. She can smash a watermelon between her thighs. It's Anastasia. Oh, Anastasia. Holy cow. Damn it, quit knocking me back. Alright. Hey, She's right there. Damn it, don't knock me back. Hmm. At least I could take her out, keep her from attacking us. Okay, guys, better look out for this girl because she'll stick you right up her butt. It's run. <laughs> she'll stick you right up her butt. All right, uh, let's use my old. Breathe it in. Uh, okay, my ass to get nervous now. You should. I am not one to be trifled with. We're really very sorry you had to come to bite. Watch out for our next dancer, people. She's the undefeated Titan of Twerking. Say hello to Trixie. The Titan of Twerking. I like your hair, but that's about all I like of you. <laughs> Gotta keep breaking through. What? How come I can't use this? Hmm, that's weird. Oh, because she's right here. Duh. <laughs> Damn it, Dave. I thought she was in the middle. Look out, ladies oh, and no. here comes the queen of quippies, the mistress of BDSM, your dominatrix dream come true. It's spontaneous bootay. Hey, honey, you ain't ready for this bootay. Bootay. Oh, my God. I'm going to crush you in my booty cheeks. I'm going <laughs> to your body with my booty, baby. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> 
That was the woman that cured uh, Chef when they took him to the Peppermint Hippo. Okay, when this meter fills, spontaneous Boote will interrupt the current turn and attack immediately. Here comes death by spontaneous Boote. Again. So, I guess I gotta avoid her? I don't know. Or take them out before she attacks me? Uh oh. At least I'm not in the danger zone. I know. Damn it, you gotta move fast. Oh no. Oh fuck. That was bad. She's got infinite health. Oh shit, I'm in trouble. I am in big trouble. Oh man, she just sat right on me. <laughs> Good thing I'm already dead. Okay. There we go. Just gotta blaze through. As long as I keep getting that protection, I'll be okay. And just keep dashing forward. Uh, just keep. God damn it! Oh my god. This is fucking terrible. Damn it. I didn't realize it was my turn. I gotta start pay uh, looking at the bottom right so I can tell when it, like, it's like, oh, I need to go fast. I know which move I need to use, so it's just a matter of doing it. <clears throat> nice. <laughs> that was a nice move, I must admit. God, this is fucking hard. They keep knocking me back. That's true. Keep your hand off the talent. I ain't worried about my alt. I'm just trying to get to the end of the room and end this shit. Oh, thank God. That was fucking rough. That was probably the hardest battle so far. I wonder if there's going to be more uh, scenarios like that where you got to get from one end of the room to the other. What? Get inside. Go on, scram. I ain't afraid to use this thing. Ha! Nice. Okay, well, I said I wanted to keep going until uh, the end of this, but, I mean, shit, it's still going on, and this episode's gone on long enough. I'm sorry, you guys, I'm going to have to go ahead and end it here, and uh, we'll pick right back up where we left off in the next episode. So, thank you guys very much for watching this episode. I'll be back later with another video. I hope to see you there. My name is Dave, and I am the One Man Ray. See ya!